Oh, there's a fish though. Holy. Yeah. That's a good one. I'll need the net for sure, man. I'm sure this spot looks familiar to some. So the day was the weekend before bass season opens. We're gonna throw some ultralight multi-species lures around and see what we can get into one last time before we start targeting bass. So come along. Yeah, look. Oh, 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 that was a bad one. Oh, <laughs> that last bit looked bad. Oh, <laughs> oh, shit. oh. Just twist the ankle, terrible. Are you good? Are you good to walk? Oh, yeah, I should be all right. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was a bad one. Oh, god, ass over tea kettle there. <laughs> Just turn around. <laughs> I saw that. How many gobies can you catch? There we go, bud. Oh, there we go. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, real. Woo! That's all right. Yeah, that's like the biggest one in the whole batch down here. There's that bass just freaking out. That'd be fun. Can you even do time lapses on here? Yep. So your battery does. Oh yeah, getting bites here. I think there's just, uh, oh, that's a small bluegill. Got him though. That's right. Another dink gill. Nice colors on him. I guess it's just like a hybrid, pumpkin seed hybrid or something. Maybe I've always wondered. If you're watching this and you know about bluegill, let me know what causes these colors. Like what causes that color variation? You know where that blue is a bit more pronounced? Some gills have it, some don't. Not quite a pumpkin seed though, it doesn't look like it. Oh, smallest of the day. By far, that's, it's fun. Move along, little fella. They're all just tiny. I would say, honestly, the best plan of action would be move on, come back. Hit spots quick, let time pass, see how it changes. And then make our way back, that's not a bad idea. I'm down, because really, I mean, we can, I don't know, grind out a fish or two here, but yeah. I don't need to. Oh, <laughs> that would have been bad. That would have been bad, bud. What's that? Holy jeez. It's a big, it's a big gill. All right, there we go. It's got some weight to him on the medium light. Dang, it's a nice one. Big mouth on him. Don't mind that at all. I mean, that's not a small jig by any means. Toss him back in. Wish I had the ultralight for that fish, man. That would have been a fun fight. I mean, this is the medium light and it was bending her out. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh, what is that? Dude. Tiny large one, I think. 
Yeah, wow, oh, it came right off. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, like it was out deep in the middle. I mean, it wasn't deep, but it was out like far. What did he do to my bait? He's got it all curled up here. I didn't even think he had that like hook in him. I mean, look at this. Just a mess. Wow. This sucks. A lot harder. So this is where all the weeds went. Oh, there's a fish though. Holy. Yeah. That's a good one. I'll need the net for sure, man. I think I'm in weeds too. Dude, he just snagged me up, I think. Oh no, there we go. Yeah. What is that? Just a large round? It's a large round. Oh no, that's a small one. Oh, he's not that. No, yeah, it's fine. It was just the weeds that were the. All right. You just cast. Yeah. And then just went back. Yeah. Just hoping you. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. What weight size you got on? Three thirty second. Okay, yeah. yeah, it's not great, but there we go. Holy. Yeah, not bad. A little small. Oh. Oh, 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 all in there, bro. What do you mean? Oh, all right, all right, all right, here you go. I don't see no bluegill. Oh, there he is. That guy's tiny. Oh, you waited too, you went too early. What are you kidding me? It was in his mouth. Not enough, though. I think a falling compilation. <laughs> We're almost there, eh? I wish you had the GoPro for that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Just that so... went up there too on Oh, that's a fish. Yeah. I think so. Oh yeah. What is that? So, what did I? What is oh, are you kidding me, <laughs> dude? It's, it's a tiny like bluegill, pumpkin seed. Holy! I just that's a good size, I guess. Oh no! I dropped them back into the water. Chomp the three thirty second ounce jig. Like way out deep too. I now realize that I totally forgot to record an outro there. Um, just got back from the post fishing beer and I've done my ankle in on that fall. Early on the trip, I guess I just powered through it. As soon as I sat down, took my weight off it. I can't move the thing. So, was it worth those fish? Probably not, but overall it was a pretty good day fishing, I think. Stay tuned as uh, next weekend we're getting out for bass opener. Thank you for watching everyone. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, tight lines out there.